Good morning, good afternoon, good evening, ladies, gentlemen, and those who are neither wherever you are in the world. I'm Ramblin' Rusty Elm, and you're watching Ramblin' with Rusty, Starfield Edition. Last time on Ramblin' with Rusty, we went and found our first temple and tower, reported back to Constellation, and got our butt reamed a little bit more about choosing the natural and safe method of getting rid of the Terramorphs over the far more dangerous and quicker method of using the micro. Uh, today we are headed to Volnite Vol Alpha to the city of Neon where we have some missions to get done and we have an artifact to pick up. So without further ado, let's get into it. Now, as you can tell from the fact that I was able to fast travel here, I have been to Volai a couple of times to sell stuff. So, you're going to miss some of the uh, early conversational cues that provide some of the missions. But, nonetheless, we have those missions, ah, and we'll that. get them done. Construction. Incense, industrial chemicals of every kind, but they still can't get rid of the odor of chasm bass. We need to stop by the Stroud Eklund offices. There are certain authorization procedures when large funds are being transferred, even for something like this. Okay, yes, we need to escort him to see his wife. Keep moving. The scanners won't touch you. Keep it moving. Keep it moving. Let's see. Strad Eklund is this one. If I remember right. Word is the Borealis. You know, the DJ? Well, she's moping around because she lost something important. No, nope, it wasn't this way, it's the other way. Oh, that's right, we need to go to... The one we want is in the tower. Don't go causing trouble. Mr. Strout, we didn't know you were coming in. It's all right. I just need to have a short chat with my counterpart. Is she in today? Yes. Uh, allow me to bust you in, sir. You know, Mr. Strout, you are so lucky. Walter. Issa. Shall we continue from last time? The luxury cruise line market is completely outside of our core competencies. If you're wondering what that smell it, is, is a mistake. Neon. No, I'm here about... Wait a minute, a mistake. Our ship designers are the best in the settled systems. They design personal craft and military Sorry, ships. Sorry, I'm busy at the moment. Large-scale accommodations and hospitality is a completely different beast. Oh, I'm so sorry. Here I am, arguing with my partner. <laughs> and you're just standing right here. Issa Eklund, the hyphenated Eklund in our glorious company's branding. Oh, aren't you lovely? Walter, wherever did you meet your new friend? I'm jealous. A colleague from Constellation. Ah, yes, the daring explorers. 
my partner is so infatuated with. <laughs> you should hear him reciting that speech. <clears throat> There's no need to go into that. <laughs> oh, my heart skips a beat when he does it. Really, it does. Such passion. If he talked to the board that way, I wouldn't need to placate them so much. I know. It's my favorite hobby. Now, why are you here, my dear? The board meeting isn't for a while, and our vacations aren't coming up either. It's the discretionary fund, Issa. I need all of it. Ugh. This wouldn't have anything to do with that meeting you've set up at the Astro Lounge, would it? I never said that. Did you have an agent hack into my files again? Only after you had one hack into mine. Tell me. Can mutual distrust lead to a point where it's actually the same as mutual trust? Oh, don't mind the two of us. Challenging each other intellectually is a cornerstone of our relationship. Now I must point out the obvious. The Astral Lounge. Huh? It's a remarkably insecure location. That was the point. Neutral territory in the open. With no leverage. Oh, you must let me help. It's been too long. I have this all taken care of. Some investigation into the cellar. What's motivating them? Then, some preliminary casing of the Astral Lounge for security flaws. Give you the advantage if things go wrong. Bribe a few bouncers, alter the codes on the doors. Yes, exactly. I hate being selfish, but I would like some time with my husband. We need to go through the fund authorizations anyway. James Newell is the broker who knows our seller. He'll be able to help you find out more about them. And it shouldn't be hard to find the Astral Lounge. Here, let me at least give you some operation funds since I won't be joining you. Meet me back here. I'm going to be present for the negotiation. I'm not leaving you to the Neon Sharks, I promise. Well, you'd be better off if you did. Thousand credits operates. Oh my god. Okay, core kinetics. Let's go get some real operational things. What? Ready for some plenty of choice. You need firepower. You know where to find us. Cause any trouble, and I'll drag you straight to lockup. I really do hate the guards here. Now is the time to enhance your life. Here at Enhance, we are rule out. Right. Have your fun. Live your best life. Scram. I'm on duty. Personal products. So you can take reliance with you wherever. Hiring the best and brightest of today on our future time. Oh, boots. Hey there. If you're looking for supplies, this is the place. Maybe I did. Maybe I didn't. Hmm. Had a freelancer trail the seller back to his place. Sleep crate one. Could possibly want. We're fully stocked okay. and ready to sell. Sure. Have a look. Watch your back out there. Hey there, friend. Need something? Duel's good as a Yeah? What do you want? Core Kinetics isn't the only game. Help yourself. Always keep plenty of ammo in stock, too.
Rather be doing this than getting mixed up with the gangs. And this is sleep great. I'm not sure how much longer I can survive doing this last job. Xenofresh charges us a licensing fee to fish near Neon. Security's got his eyes on Saburo Okadigbo. That guy's trouble for the status quo, if you know what I mean. Feel like making a purchase today? Oh, okay, yeah. That'd be extremely helpful. I honestly don't know what to say. Mm. Fair mm. enough. Just be careful when you're dealing with Siegert. He can be surprisingly unreasonable when he's cornered. Realysis music is top tier level stuff. But Thanks for stopping by our shop. Okay, so that deals with. Oh, yeah, I agree. Gets that one started. Looking to... <sighs> what can I get you? You do that. Huh. You might want to get that moonset. I've been thinking about getting a pad or something. Huh. <laughs> I'm glad you see sticks is more than just a possession. The lowlife that did this to my buddy calls himself Warlord. <laughs> you can probably find him somewhere near Euphorica. Scare the crap out of this punk. And it'll teach all the abside lunatics that nobody messes with me and the sticks. You know, sticks, crime in this city gets worse by the day. Van. The... Okay, that gets that one started, that one started. Come on in, please have a good look around. My dear mother would have said the same thing. The fees here are quite expensive and I'm barely making ends meet, but I've always been quite stubborn. It has not always been easy, but I've been at this location for eight years and I won't give up. My business is my pride and joy. You won't find another store like mine on Neon. So please, support my business with your patronage. You won't be disappointed. Yes, I'm aware of James's objections. That's partly why I don't go to the meetings. But if I don't pay Dexler, I'll lose my business. And what good would joining the Alliance do then? So, really, 
Now, I don't have a choice here. If they want to fight Neon Security, they can. But I need to protect my livelihood. Really? I didn't know that. But I suppose they used to treat me with respect uh, until I started paying the protection. But they have to understand. I could lose my business if I don't pay Dexler's fees. Well, maybe she was wrong. I try to be a good man, but in Neon, good men starve. And why is that? They have a funny way of showing it. James just doesn't give me a cold shoulder. It's basically frozen. It starts and ends with Bayou, and Dexler works for him. Ugh, you are a very difficult person. I don't. The man is as corrupt as they come. And that's saying something, given where we are. <sighs> Maybe it really is for the best. Okay, you've convinced me. I will stop paying Dexla his safety assurance fee. And tell the Newells I will come to the next meeting. Maybe I will even bring some beverages and snacks. You can't stand up to neon security on an empty stomach. Well, that went surprisingly not the way I expected. Don't worry. Okay. If you don't see it, you... Hmm. I passed by the okay. store today, boss. Let's settle this it once and for it. all. Velocity uh, or Chimera? That that you kidding? Chimera, all day. Why do you think I'm here? I don't know. Chimera's nice, but Velocity, that will get you hammered. See, you just proved my point. Down your third velocity, and you're out cold. By the third chimera, you're floating on frickin' cloud nine. I don't know about you, but that's where I'd rather be. Yeah, I guess you're right. Where the hell did Micah learn to mix a drink like that, anyway? Hope the Let's face it, some people are just... Data. gifted. Upside is ours. The Strikers are a bunch of babies. Afraid of a little blood. You like art? Oh, you'll like this. Just head on over to Neon Tactical and check out the robot. It's my best work. <laughs> that Cyclops should be thanking me. I dressed up his toy real nice, gave him a total makeover. He's lucky that's all I did after what that thing did to my crew. Sure. Thanks, Micah. I keep yeah, I do. 
And I'll make art out of your guts if you step out of line. Relaxation today. Perhaps I could interest you in a visit to the members lounge? <sighs> Wish I could. Fine by me, punk. Let's paint the walls with your blood. Understandable. This is getting out of control. Come on. Please let me know. This is out of control. Well, bourbon or whiskey, please, if you got it. I'll have that ready for you shortly. Thanks, Michael. Wrong weapon for the job, but it got it done. You got a bit there. I need to. Need to talk to him again. Need a weapon? Yeah. What do you want? Good work. I hope you made him squirm. Now, that's exactly how you send a message. Still, I won't argue with results. Thanks. Styx is gonna get a new paint job, a coat of wax, the works. He's gonna look brand new. Oh, and here, for your trouble. <sighs> Sometimes, Styx, I wonder how things would've been different if I took a different path. can keep from killing each other. I just might have a good day. Submit your application now at the nearest I can't wait for my next break. You won't find better weapons than Hi. Welcome to Arboron. Sure. Have a look. Come back soon. Welcome to Newell's. If you have a moment, say hello to my wife. Well, I'll be. And all you had to do was... talk to him? Meanwhile, I was so damn stubborn, I made this whole thing harder than it had to be. Given you almost and I'd went still blind, be wandering around that storage that helpless, in your eye. if not for you. Yeah, Thanks for your help on this. The Merchants' Alliance is finally united. I don't know if we'll ever get a fair shake in the city, but it's a start. I had to chase more zone heads out of here today. Hey there, friend. Need something? Duel's Goods has a full line of equipment and accessories for all your Everything good? Nothing to report? Nope, nothing. Pretty slow day so far. See, I told you. Yeah, to purchase Look some at this mining place. Goods? Ridiculous, right? Welcome, welcome, my Why friend. It's been a long time since I've seen a new face. On an ocean planet. Exactly. I I'm afraid it is. Place is still open. You see, I when I opened this shop, before this I had grand accident. ambitions of creating a mining uh, supply sure. empire on Volai. Yet buy. here I am, yeah, only sure. a few years later, pockets credits, empty, and my business like on the verge of closure. It is a sad day. That would be a blessing, my friend. You would do that for a total stranger? Bless you. I've come up with an idea that I'm hoping will generate a... 
if you could bring these flyers to some of the other vendors in Neon. Wonderful. Simply wonderful. You have no idea the weight you have lifted from my shoulders. I appreciate your help. If there's anything I can do, anything at all, please let me know. Certainly, my friend. I hope you have a glorious day, my friend. I'm interested in some of your mining gear, but I'm going to need it. I'm not going to say this twice. Get the hell away. Line of equipment and Dietrich's been great at the meetings. Wish she'd stay. Here, let me see that. Oh, not a bad idea. We might be onto something here. Thanks for bringing this to me. Tell everyone you know about our store. <sighs> Core Kinetics isn't the only game in town, you know. Don't need it, don't want it. Take it somewhere else. You ever get nightmare sticks about the war? I'm sorry. I did not understand your query. Back off. That's an order, not a suggestion. If it needs something. Nah, I don't think I want to get mixed up in that. <laughs> yes, let's. You done here? Time to move on. To become part of the most advanced technology world in its southern We have everything you need for all your days. Joining the merch, James and I have a few ideas about how business could always be better. I'll take that. Sure, I have everything you need to explore the settled systems. I don't remember if I saw the stuff to him or not. Apparently I did. Oh my goodness, another poor soul. All right, tell me what happened to you. Is it an Aurora overdose? Something else, perhaps? He isn't gonna, you know, rat me out to anyone, right? You kidding? No one cares if you're addicted to the stuff. Hell, that's what they want. Oh, well, that's quite unusual. But you're welcome here just the same. Since you're clearly a first-time visitor to Reliant Neon, I'd love to offer you a free checkup, but I'm afraid I'm dangerously low on supplies. Every day is a busy day here, but that isn't why I'm low on supplies. You see, I'm a bit... at odds with the current administrator of Neon. His drug is turning the streets into a graveyard, and he doesn't seem to care. We've argued about it on more than one occasion, and all he's done is try to persuade me to quit. Thinning out my supply chain is his newest tactic. Then you understand what I'm up against. At this point, I've resorted to asking anyone that has a ship registered outside of the Voli system to bring me medical supplies. I pay them for the supplies, of course, but it's the only way I can sneak them past Bayou's people at the spaceport. Now, if there's anything else I can do for you, anything at all, you just let me know. That would be amazingly helpful. It's a relief to meet someone who gives a damn about anyone other than themselves for a change. Oh, and I'll pay you directly for the supplies, of course. It's the only way I can sneak them past Bayou's people at the spaceport.
As much as I'd like to believe that, let's wait and see how you feel after you make the delivery. Anyway, I have a contact over at the clinic in the Narian system. Abby Edding? She's one of the nurses there. She'll get you started. Thank you so much for doing this. You have no idea how helpful it'll be for the poor folk that live in Ebside. I wouldn't mind a bit of extra traffic as long as the supplies allow for it. A few extra credits never hurt. I have a few items left, I think. If you need help, remember Reliant. you drag me in here? You said all of our items are guaranteed nice to be of the highest so quality. Are. <sighs> are you sure you're in the right place? Do you certainly don't look like one of our usual clientele. Hey, you're the one that told me she has expensive tastes. <laughs> there's expensive, and then there's the Emporium. <laughs> I take it from your tone I've made an error in judgment. Please forgive my disrespect. We have quite a few... Well, shall we say, thugs that find their way into my establishment and create a disturbance. In fact, there's a particular Seoka member who calls himself Headlock, who repeatedly torments me by damaging my goons. You mean kill him? Even if I wanted to, well, I wouldn't know how. I've never been terribly good at that sort of thing. Anyway, I've already taken up too much of your valuable time. Was there anything else I could help you with? Oh my goodness, that's such a relief. You have no idea. Thank you for accepting my offer. Headlock's quite a dangerous gentleman. I believe you can... Whatever it takes. Just don't go getting yourself killed on my behalf. Anyway, that's really all I know. Head back here when you've taken care of the situation. Good luck. Cash only, please. Oh? Well, maybe I'll give it some thought. Maybe. Come back soon. You never know what we'll have for sale. Yeah, all right, ladies and gentlemen, we're going to call that an episode for the day. And next week we will continue on around Neon here at Phoenix. Can't hardly hear myself thinking. So we're going to call that an episode for the evening, ladies and gentlemen. Uh, next week we will continue on with stuff here in Neon. In the meantime, I'm Ramblin' Rusty Ellen. Have a good night, and don't forget to stop and smell the roses.